Hello everybody, welcome to the Impressive channel. Last night Cardi B launched her fashion line with Fashion Nova and she hosted a huge party. Now at the party she invited several female rappers to perform. One of them was Brianna Perry, another one was Dream Doll, and Saweetie also performed as well. And I have to say I really like Saweetie's performance. She had her dancers with her, she's getting better at her stage presence. I liked her performance. Also, Young Miami from the City Girls performed as well, and Cardi B did close off the show by performing her own set of songs, and Cardi did her thing as well. I didn't watch the show in its entirety, but from the clips that I've seen, it seems like it was a fun event. Now, I was more interested in what Cardi B's clothing line with Fashion Nova looked like, and I did browse on the site, and the outfits were very classic, very classy. They were well put together on the models, and it made it really appealing. So I was really surprised at how good the line was. I know that's kind of crazy, but I never thought of Fashion Nova as a high-end line. However, it seems as if Cardi B is switching up the game over there. So congrats to Cardi B, and congrats to her again because her line sold out within hours after it launched. Hey everybody, so my Fashion Nova collection sold out a couple of hours ago and I would like to say thank you anybody that purchased and I'm sorry for anybody that couldn't get to it. We will be restocking some items for Black Friday and we will restock the collection in two or three weeks. And I want to thank everybody that came out to my party and I want to thank the celebrities that came out to my party as well. I know you guys have a busy schedule so for you guys to come out and support me and my dream, I want to say thank you if you ever need anything. I left for a dollar. I want to thank the girls that perform, Dream Doll, Saweetie, City Girls, and um, Brittany. Thank you guys so much. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed my collection. And it's crazy. All my dreams is coming true, yo. My dreams is really coming true. I'm so thankful. And, um, yep. There's a whole bunch of shit that's gonna come out, and I'm gonna say thank you so much. I gotta be up at 6 30, guys. Goodbye. Cardi B is really out here doing her thing. I can't hate on it. And it seems as if ever since she took a break from social media, things have been going in a more positive direction for her because she was engaging herself in a lot of negativity. And let me just say, if you're trying to grow your career and your empire, you cannot be engaging in any drama because you have a lot to lose. And now I can see that she's staying focused and getting her bag. And that's what's up. Congrats to Cardi B again. Now let me change subjects for a little bit because there was some foolishness that happened at Cardi's Fashion Nova party. Now there is this little girl named Bad Baby, also known as the Catch Me Outside girl from Dr. Phil. She was trying to start a fight with Iggy Azalea. <laughs> have to look at the road but I got a long drive so I want to say this I get that this little girl has made a name for herself acting a damn fool on television and online but I'm a grown-up I'm not about to waste my energy on that shit or be fighting a kid in a club come on I came to get a check I left with a check you left with your bag stuffed over there and you look silly. I'm not gonna be scrambling around on the floor for a 15 year old girl on the internet. I salute Iggy for acting like the grown woman she is and not entertaining that child. And let me say this about this little bad baby girl. If she keeps acting like a fool at these events and trying to start fights with people, she's gonna wind up in the hospital. I promise you that. She really needs to calm down because it's never cool to attack somebody in public. It's never cool to try to gain clout by starting drama. None of that is cool. That makes you look crazy. And I know that she's just a child, but I don't like the fact that the people around